<clears throat> Alright, good morning. Uh, my name is uh, Tim Mallow. This is my M35 Alpha truck. Uh, there's a fuel leak <clears throat> that developed in the um, primary fuel filter, which uh, filters fuel, of course. Uh, the filter housing itself is made out of steel, and there's a filter element inside of it. it its basic function is to prevent uh, particulates from getting into the fuel injection system. This thing developed a leak for some reason, <clears throat> a pinhole leak if you will, um, down near the apex of the filter, it's filter housing itself. And uh, having identified this, I contemplated a number of solutions, one of which was to replace the filter, but then I thought there might be an easier way. So what I did is I sanded down the um, the housing got back past the paint, got down the bare metal, scratched it up with 60 grit sandpaper, cleaned it with acetone, let it drain for about 24 hours to eliminate all diesel fuel from it, and then um, wiped it down with acetone again, got it good, good and clean, and applied two coats of epoxy. This is just a basic two part epoxy, a 30 minute dry time. And so now I'm going to fire the truck up after uh, an additional 15 hours of curing and see if this thing holds. So the camera right now is pointed towards the fuel filter and you might see some fuel be being dripping out of the uh, stopcock which I'm going to close off at this point because um, we don't want the fuel to get into the camera obviously and here we're trying to prove that this leak actually has been sealed up. So I'm just going to tighten this up a little bit <clears throat> with a uh, crescent wrench and then crawl into the cab shortly and uh, see if this thing actually works. If it does, then I'm good to go. If it doesn't, well, then I've got to replace the fuel filter housing. However, I have a feeling that even if it does work for now, it probably will fail in the future. So this is probably more of an R&D drill in trying to see if epoxy actually does work by sealing up fuel leaks. My dad used to make gasoline tanks out of epoxy and fiberglass cloths, so this, I'm just working off that theory. Anyway, here goes. Going up to the cab. Alright, there's a fuel pump going. It doesn't appear to be leaking. I'm going to fire the truck up. It definitely appears to be holding up. 